What you doing? Hi guys, this is Jill Isabel, and I am Ooh. trying to record. I'm waiting for my husband to get the remote that just failed. He being annoying. Jill Isabel, good, huh? Can you please go get the remote? Yeah, yeah. Anyway, I want to give you guys because the TV's loud. We well, gotta get my heads up. Bro. I ain't trying to get no heads up about that. I'm trying to give them a review of how my intermediate intermediate fasting has been going. When uh, when you let them know you were back. Don't you worry about it. Just get the. I ain't saying do it with both tape. Because first of all, you don't watch my tape like that. There you go. Right. You have a tape on do it with her husband supporting. And you don't be feeling like you do. You don't need that stuff. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> How you support me? I be supporting you too. I watch your tape. I ain't seen no tape. I just told you that. I be supporting you too. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Anyway, so um, this up. is my first week of intermediate fasting. I started last Saturday, mm-hmm. and today is Thursday, so I have two more days to go. I am excited, babe. Can you please get that remote? This don't make no sense. And crack is wet. So, anyway, it's late night, guys. That's why you see my hair scarf on. Basically, um, I had a rough start uh, because a lot of things has been going on this week. This week was my niece's birthday. She's 22. She's 22. And so we went to the Japanese steakhouse. And um, it's a rough start because it's a lot of food. And... I mean, at that point, it was day three for me, but I couldn't even finish my plate, and usually I could finish at least three-fourths of my plate, and I could not, so I had to split it like almost three days. That's how much, you know, I couldn't eat that. Um, I have been, this first week has been a challenge as far as time frames. I've been getting home late, and so um, even when I get home, I have to run out to the store, different stuff, so unorganized. This first week, we're going through a rene- mini renovation of getting our floors redone. Are you going to participate or are you going to hate? I'm listening. Because right now, the viewers don't want to hear you hooing. I just look at the words you told me. What do you mean? It's just a small disorganization going Anyway, on. it's a lot of unorganization downstairs, it's guys. Daily. I would show you, but I don't feel like it. It's daily. So, um... He is just, I don't know why he acting like that. But anyway, so yeah, I wanted to catch you up. So this week, I had a lot of late means at work, and so I would get home, and um, it just wouldn't be good. So I wanted to just let you all know this first week, technically, I'm trying not to count it, although it does count. Um, Saturday, I will officially be one weekend. I'm just letting you all know I've eaten everything from Taco Bell this week to um uh Japanese steakhouse. What else did we have? I'm gonna eat at home. Anyway, um I've had no when we had Wendy's. Boy stop playing. We had Wendy's, we had some everything. This week has just been a really bad week. Cold, huh, <laughs> okay. I bought that Wendy's and you complained about it? I ain't complaining to come on baby what you know go home up for Okay, that's fine, but I bought it for you, and don't complain about my food. So, anyway, uh, what else we did have? I cannot think, but I just know that this week has been a really bad week. I don't think, that personally, by Saturday, and I do a weigh-in, that it I'm going to lose a lot uh, due to the fact that... Um, like I said, when you go through a renovation, your kitchen is halfway together and things of that sort. That's just what kind of weekend start I, I'm off to. But I'm not going to give up. I'm going to keep going into next week. It's been This has been, um, for me, the experience has been quite easy. It has not been hard at all. Because in my mind, I fixated on, hey, you're just skipping breakfast. That's it. Basically, you eat dinner. You snoring? Basically, you, I'm eating dinner, and after dinner, 
then I'm skipping breakfast. That's how I fixated in my mind is working. So I'm at work. I don't eat to, um, I'm on the 16, eight plan, but like I said, this week going to take my niece out to eat for her birthday and just being out late, getting groceries, do just coming home late for meetings and stuff like that has really thrown me off. And so every day this week, I have not did 16 hours. Um, at the least, I think I did like 13. Um, but I think in my mind for my first week, that's pretty good. So like I said, I don't think I'm going to lose a lot this week. I'm probably going to lose a few inches more than anything um, because I do see that my thighs are getting a little bit smaller, like really slowly but surely. So I could tell that the fix was taking place. I just need to stay stable. Um, I was listening to another YouTuber um, earlier this week that encouraged me. She was saying that she was also on the intermediate fasting plan. And she decided that, like, she started had a rough start too. But then she went to being... Um, you know, eating better. And so that's what I'm trying to do um, today for breakfast or lunch, rather. I had a school lunch, which I'm a teacher. So at my school, we had spaghetti and um, and broccoli. And so I got two helpings of broccoli and some spaghetti. They did some kind of wheat pasta-like noodles. Um, and so it wasn't so bad. And then after work, I had some, like a half a chicken breast and... Um, a salad that I just kind of threw together um, and then um, tonight I had for dinner we went my daughter and I we went to Chick-fil-a I had a fruit bowl and like a kids meal with a fruit bowl in it um, and a water a large water and then I just got some of her fries and I'm trying not to do like you know overindulge but at the same time I don't want to deprive myself because I think it's more of a mind thing than anything like I've heard today that it's 80% of a mind mind change and body like 15% of exercise. And speaking of which, I did exercise uh, this week. I think I did it three times so far. I'm going for four times because, four or five times actually because I have Friday and Saturday as well. So um, I'm aiming for something. And what I do, I don't do anything. Listen, I'm all about the easy life. I don't do anything strenuous. I will walk around my neighborhood for maybe uh, about 30, 30 minutes to, I'm trying to aim up to an hour. So at the most, it'll be like 40, 50. So um, I'm getting better with the longevity as far as walking goes. And then um, I have a treadmill. Um, I have a treadmill here at home that I got on today for like 20 minutes of like an incline. And so I'm doing that. But I just wanted to catch you guys up next second week when I really do a weigh-in and I'm thinking I don't need to do a weigh-in this first week let's skip this first week guys let's do it I'm, so I'm not gonna weigh in on Saturday let's do it next Saturday and so I really am excited I'm gonna show you pictures because I took pictures of before now that's that's what I will show you I will show you my starting weight and I will be showing you my before picture um, and go from there um, all right, guys, have a great night. This was just an eight-minute video, a quick check-in. Um, for next week's video, I definitely will be displaying food, and I definitely will be displaying... Hey, baby. What are you doing? Can't even see you. No, you're supposed to be in the bed sleep. Don't you got school tomorrow? I just took a long bath. Oh, okay. You can do that nail thing tomorrow. I'll put my nail thing back and go to bed. Okay. All right, guys. So this is um, late night shenanigans. I have a 12-year-old that's supposed to be in the bed about 9, 9.30ish. And truth be told, she don't get to bed to super late every day. And so that was just, she's asking for my nail thing. And it is like 10.30. She just got out of the bathtub. So, but we were out late, and so that's probably why she um, did that so late tonight. Um, but anyway, yeah. Next week video for the second week check-in on my intermediate fasting. I definitely will be showing you guys um, uh, more of my food choices and more of my exercising and just different stuff, talking about it, going more into depth about this. We're here together. Let's go ahead and start this journey together. Um, this is my first week. I know you can do it. Jump on board. Um, 
And then, um, and also next week, I'll talk about the different uh, time frames that you can do intermediate fasting, like 16, 8. So you do 16 hours of fasting, 8 hours of uh, eating window. And then um, I think it's just like um, 12, 8. No, it's not 12. But anyway, so I will talk about that next week. Guys, I'm signing off. Have a good night.